And so we started doing a little bit of research, and terahertz is a real thing. It is a, it is a real thing. Terahertz at frequency is somewhere between microwave, x-ray, and microwave. And that frequency, when applied to the body, has some very strong beneficial effects. Now, let me tell you, Kai talked a little bit this morning about not skimming the surface when you're trying to learn something, looking into it deep. I'm kind of like a rock that is skipped across the lake. I know a lot about nothing. <laughs> because I just <laughs> kind of skipped the surface. Now, Shelby's a little better. She'll actually put on a snorkel mask and go down a little bit. Kai gets in a freaking submarine. <laughs> he goes so deep that none of us understand what he's saying. <laughs> but he understands if something is real, good, and worthwhile. And so that's what makes what we do, I think, beneficial to you. So we looked at that and said, okay, so how is that blower, light, and quartz making terahertz? Because it does, it can be measured. Well, we found out when you blow air, or any type of energy, air, light, water, through a quartz tube, as it passes across that quartz tube, it's the silicon, and Kai can go into more detail on that, it actually creates that terahertz frequency for a short distance. So our thing was, well, what can we do to make that better? What it came down to is, well, we need the blower to get the air. We need the lights. Now, the lights we felt were important. <clears throat> I think though the original one had blue lights in it. I'm not going to stay. We felt it right needed to be in there as well. You're going to learn a lot about that today and tomorrow. But red and blue lights beamed right in front of the blower, right behind the blower, so it's going through. We get the 660 and the 470 wavelengths going through that, that quartz tube. But then we did something different. We took that quartz tube. We took it out. Oh, we had our own name. Then we bought all of the chakra stones. <laughs> get where I'm going with this? We took those seven stones seven stones and we ground them up into like a coarse I won't say sand because they're pretty coarse yeah. they're coarse, coarse rocks I'm just a cheering section over here I'm, just <laughs> over here. I'm so sorry Lord. I so anyway, I love it. I the last two inches of that quartz tube we line with an epoxy on the inside and then we stick that quartz tube down in those stones and we pull it up that's got all seven of those stones. So you've got your amethyst, you've got your lapis lucy, or whatever you call that. And then those are like, he always calls yeah. her Lucy. <laughs> he always does. Whatever it is, all those stones, and they're blended well, and they form this two inch tunnel at the very end. So as this is picking up that terahertz frequencies, it's going through quartz. With the wavelengths of red and blue, it gets all those frequencies of the stones. It is, it's not necessarily giving you those stone frequencies. What those stones are doing is making that terahertz wave out to here. We estimate that because we haven't purchased the machine to test it, but by just doing our anecdotal testing, we're about a foot 18 inches. Okay? So when you're using well, now, let me chime in just, uh, just on that. It was so critical based on what, what he tore apart before to what we added. When we added stones, we know we just needed we needed to have stones in it because that was part of the process of creating creating a natural terror terrorist reaction. And so we wanted to make sure the stones were in there so that natural reaction took place. And because of the coarseness of them, we knew that we would pick up more of a reaction as far as breaking up the wavelength as it goes through. And so that was super critical. That, that was not a, a nice to have. That was not a just make it a little bit better. That was a massive change to what is in the marketplace. That alone is worth well worth what is in there as far as a terrorist experience. If you understand terror hurts or want to 
dive into what terrorists are and what they can do to the body, how they influence the body, you, I, the one thing that we wanted to make sure was, it wasn't just gonna be a small change. We, like Richard Branson said, change people's lives, right? You don't take it, you don't make it small when you change people's lives and it's critical that that wavelength is created in that way and not just in one way, you have multiple ways now. Actually, we have about, about eight ways that it's passing through in which we're creating the terrorist frequency, okay? Now all of that, just by itself, is enough. But there's more. We went one more step. <laughs> but there's more. Silver and gold. Okay. So, at the beginning of that Quartz tube, there is a stainless steel piece of metal that has been uh, gold plated, 24 karat gold plate. At the one at the end, if you look, it's kind of a symbol that should be familiar to all of you. This is a stainless steel plate that has been silver plated. 99.9 silver plate. Why is the gold and the silver important? Because as the air passes through and the frequencies are generated, you have a silver and gold ionic exchange, which makes that end frequency coming out even more powerful, more stable, hence because the longer range. Woo! When we look at that, one of the, so when we look at these key parts that are that are in it, we're looking at obviously we wanted to make sure we have something that was really strong and would last for a long time, right? So we have a very powerful motor in it that was bigger and better. Of course, we went from a two hundred we went from a two hundred hour motor to a two thousand hour motor. <laughs> so it's not only the motor. Now you would think by doing that we would take the noise level. We brought the noise level down Woo! Woo! Yeah. eight decibels. That doesn't sound like a lot, but when you're right next to it, trust me, it's a, it's a difference. So when you look at that, we're obviously we're creating the ion exchange that he just talked about with the gold plates and the silver plating, and then the semi-precious stones. You then mix in the benefits of light frequency, right? We're talking about 60. Who likes 660? Woo! I wasn't talking about the band. I was just talking about no. Everybody, does everybody have a band in here if you don't? Yes. Now, not now. I see. There's a few minutes instead of a ghost story because it's 